Welcome to the gang. Back with another video. video. Alright, y'all. This is not a good video. It really ain't bad, but it ain't a good video. You know what I'm saying? I literally just got back in the house. I was out trying to make a little money and police pulled me over. Police pulled me over. I'm in the car like, okay, I got insurance, license cool, everything. Come to find out, license not cool. Y'all remember, we got into that car accident where they totaled our Jeep. From my insurance lapping and not being all the way valid during the accident, I guess they suspended my license which they must have just suspended my license because I've been riding past police and everything and I got pulled over until today. So, they pulled me over. They told me that uh, it was from the accident and since I wasn't, no one was determined at fault yet, the case is still going on, matter of fact. They said it could have been because my uh, insurance lapsed. So hopefully that's it. But I got to go to court on March 14th to see what's going on with everything. So until then, I am licenseless. They took my license. You know what I'm saying? So can't drive. Like, this is so irritating. It's just always something happening. But, yeah, when I got pulled over, I was, like, in the middle of nowhere. Like, it was literally fields and one church. And barns. And barns and stuff. So I was already uncomfortable in that area. And then... Get pulled over. Once I get pulled over, I auto my brain automatically goes to life or death because y'all see how these police treat us young black men. You know what I'm saying? I had on a do-rag. I had on a hoodie. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, of course, I was definitely nervous. Definitely thinking a whole bunch of stuff. Just hoping everything was going to be cool. But, thankfully, the cop was a young, a younger cop, so he was pretty cool. You know what I'm saying? No bad vibes. He wasn't an asshole or nothing. He was very helpful. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just thankful for that. You know, I'm just thankful to be back at home because yeah. I done dealt with the police many a time and many a times I didn't come right back home. You feel me? So yeah. I'm just glad I'm back home. I'm um I'm laying in the bed sleep. My phone just kept vibrating. So then I looked at it. Was him? I answered it. He like some yeah um. Something bad just happened. I'm like, oh my god! Like I just got so irritated. Like I don't need nothing bad else happening. And hey, mommy, mommy wake me up. I, I get up. Yep, I wake Jamika up. I said, get up. We gotta go get daddy from the police. And yeah, he, 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 he on the phone. Up. He on the phone. Like daddy, you got your gun. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, but I can't do nothing to the police, man. <laughs> I got uh, he always he makes sure I got that boy on me at all times. Whenever I leave his house, the first thing he say, "Daddy, you got your gun." And then Mama, she wasn't feeling good last night. Now she, Tell them. Tell now she's feeling a little better. So I'm like dealing with the kids not feeling well on top of him. Now I gotta be his chauffeur. Right. This they, ain't even the first time like she experienced me in the police like. The last time I actually went to jail, like I actually yeah. was in jail for the night too. Crying. And yeah, shit. she did everything she was supposed to do to get me out of that joint though. In two days, well, the next day. Was it two days or the next no, day? No, I think it's like. Daddy. It was no, you was only there for a day. Yeah, so I was there for a day, but yeah, but she still, she yeah. she blew everybody phone up. She called all the right people, and I was out the next day. So, yeah, as soon as uh, he told me he, he was getting put over, he likes me, yeah, you got an hour. I'm like, oh, yeah, they gave me a time gosh. limit. It was like, if, uh, they was really supposed to give me 30 minutes, but he was cool. He was yeah, like, he was a cool guy. He was cop. like, I'm going to give you an hour to get somebody here. He's like, I'm going to give you an hour to get somebody here. He's like, we well, usually are really supposed to give 30 minutes before our uh, our chief or sergeant or whatever started tripping. He's like, but I'm going to give you an hour. You know what I'm saying? So that was cool. He gave me time to get somebody there. Because if I didn't, with nobody there in that time frame, they was going to tow the car, yeah, take me in, until somebody came and got me. Mm -hmm. And that would have just been all bad. That would have been extra. Super extra. So my grandma, okay, so let me tell my story. So when I um, got the call, I hurried up and I woke Jimmy go up. And I hurried up and I called my mom first. Then I called my cousin. Then I called my auntie. Then I called my other auntie. Then I called my grandma. Oh, I called my grandma after my mom, but she ain't answered. I was just calling everybody. But then my grandma 
uh, answer and call me back. But then he said he had somebody. But then I never called my grandma back. So my grandma called me back in 10 minutes like, yeah, I'm outside. I'm like, all right. right. <laughs> I, had called, I had called my auntie and she was at work. So, yeah. um, you know, she was on her way to work. So my cousin Anthony so happened to be woke and she told him to come get me or whatever. So yeah. he was on his way. But then I called him and, and told then, him not to yeah, come not no to come more. Because my grandma was outside. So. But he went in too far from the house. So he's yeah. cool. Also, go f go go follow my cousin on Instagram. Hustle brand. Hustle the brand. Hustle the brand. Go copy the merch. You know what I'm saying? It's fire. It's fire. But yeah, he on Instagram at Hustle the Brand. TikTok at Hustle the Brand. And you could go to his website. Man, man. Chill. Go follow him at Hustle the Brand on Instagram, TikTok. His website is Hustle the Brand. You know what I'm saying? He got good merch for males and females. Go, go check it out. Go check it out. He got sweatsuits. He got varsity jackets. He got everything. Face masks, underwear. He got it all. So, you know what I'm saying? Go mess with that. Um, all overall, I'm just I'm just happy I'm in in the house. I'm happy I'm at home. Cause I've been locked up before and definitely not trying to go back down that road. Like I turned my life all the way around. I ain't got time for that. You feel me? I got a family to take care of and I got supporters to please. So we definitely not taking that road at all. I don't got no choice. Cause I'm having it. I'm not having it. I'm not having it. Yeah. I, I like my freedom. Man, y'all, I'm just... I'm not really freedom, but it's just free as we is right now. I'm tired. Like, this all happened. It ain't even 10 a.m. yet. It's not even 9 uh, a.m. yet. Uh, yeah, mommy. Tell them. Tell them. Mess up my beauty sleeps. Yeah. She see herself. That's <laughs> I'm just glad that she woke up and she yeah, always on go for me. I could have... Uh, definitely deep sleep. Deep sleep. She definitely does that, and I would have been asked. Well, I wouldn't have been asked out, but, but you would have been mad at me. Like, what took a, me a minute. You ain't what if you always got your phone on silent? What if it's an emergency? Yeah, see, it now was, it's an emergency. See? And, and I'll be telling her, you never phone. know what could happen. You can't be ignoring each other for us. I don't be ignoring. No, I'm just saying, like that's just what I be saying. Like. But at the end of the day, I told you, like I literally told you, lay down and get some sleep. No, you did not. You just said you. You okay to drive? Yeah, like, like I basically, y'all, uh, before he left at the house, like, I double checked if, like, he think that was, like, a right decision to make. And he was just like, yeah, I'm good. And I'm just like, and I went to sleep. But, like, deep down the side, like, that's why I asked him, like, you sure you want to go? Like, he was like, yeah, I'm good. And he left. He called me talking about somebody just got pulled over. I'm like, are you serious? Like, you should have just cuddled in the bed with me and went to sleep. But still, y'all, at the end of the day, we still would have got put. He still would have got pulled, pulled over. over. So I'm, I'm not glad. Day or night, like. At least not, I know. No, yeah. Because they didn't send me no notice. Yeah, like, no he didn't nothing, no notice, like, nothing. And I'm just not understanding. Like, ain't nobody at fault. Case still open. So, you know what I'm saying? It really got to be the insurance thing. But I got insurance now. So, when I go there, I'm going to show them I got insurance and everything. So, hopefully, everything be cool. And hopefully, mm -hmm. they don't even charge me court costs because. I had to pay court costs last time when I went to jail. You got to pay court costs when you go to court, period, because right. the court costs. I mean, it shouldn't be as much, because last time, it was like $600. What? $600? That's how much I paid in court costs that last... Uh, Swear to God! Yeah, because I had to pay for my gun, I had to pay for my other gun, and then I had to pay for court costs. Oh, my God. My head just started hurting. So, yeah, he got to go to court. Ain't no guns involved in this one. and ain't nothing involved in this one, though, really. Oh, so March. You ahead and take your gun with you? Yeah, my gun in the car, but they... It's, they he just... They not, like, they, it's not in a protocol to ask if you have a firearm in the car no more. Oh. Uh -huh. And I'm glad because that bitch definitely loaded. Uh-oh. Well, y'all, that's the news for I don't today. I ride around with my shit unloaded. I ain't got time to cock and I need my shit ready to go in case anything happen. Man. Yeah, I'd be on go. I'm over it. Yeah, so this is our morning. This is our morning. <laughs> this is the video y'all gonna get the for today. Of black love, man. We gonna get y'all another video tomorrow. This mm. Yeah, so we gonna get y'all another video tomorrow.
Uh, yeah, uh, he got pulled over. I was calling you to see if you could help, but we already got the car back and everything. His license suspended, so yeah. I he tried just, to take me in, bro. I was just calling you to help me. I knew you probably could have helped me, but it's cool. Yeah, I probably could have. It's cool. Thank you, though, for uh, calling back and stuff. But yeah, that's what happened. His He got pulled over, but you know, something always gonna happen, but I'll call you back. Alright, right, bye. I was calling everybody. Like everybody I talk to that I know that got a car that I know that'll help me out. Cause it's not like I talk to a lot of people, but I call I everybody. Man, then I, I could have called both of my brothers, but <laughs> they was too far out. Like, oh, my, my. they wouldn't have made it in time. Cause oh yeah, west Cardo side. on the west side, and then Monte is. 55th, 65th area. So that would have been a little minute for them to get there. So I'm just grateful that her grandmother was in the area. She always willing to she help She was me not out. in the area. She I was mean, in well, the bed. It seemed like she was in the area nah, when she got there. When I called I call her first after I call my mom. And uh, then she, she, she I'm, I'm like. She be on go for yeah, me. Yeah, she be on go for him. Because I'm like, so he got pulled over. She like, oh, shit. <laughs> getting up, moving on, on the phone and stuff. So she, she was like. As soon as I caught her, she started she getting up. I love her. Y'all need to understand. That's my, that's my nigga right there. Like, we vibes. So, anyways, yeah, my she grandma. She be sorry. <laughs> her, grandma, grandma was, uh, her grandma be caring for me before her. Which ain't cool. She be like, you made him a plate. You made sure he ate. What he doing? What he got to do? What he got to do? What he got to do? <laughs> so, yeah, That's she my came. my old lady. I, I believe it is. That's yeah. my old lady. So she came, she was she was she was here, she was quick, like sonic. Like for an old person, y'all, she Yo, was she, quick. Yeah, she definitely was. And my grandma, like she that. was she was yeah, she was quick, so all right, y'all, this is the end of the video, because y'all can tell this, my son got the TV up at 100 back right. there, so I got to hurry up and turn this camera off before we get copyrighted. Copy I'm trying to make an um, intro, y'all, for our personal videos and stuff. I'm trying to make an intro, like, honestly, I want it professionally done, but... Uh, we're going to get it together. We're going to get it together, y'all. It ain't going to stop. It's going to just get better and better. Right now, we at our hard times right now, so y'all just need to... Stick through the struggle with us. Like, ooh, no, I'm, good. I'm mad. I'm gonna handle all of this as always. I know so, you're gonna handle so, it. Like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell, become part of the like post notification. Burning. You what smell is that? that? Oh, I got food in the oven. I'm about to grab it. it ain't oh, burning though. Okay. But anyways, go like, comment, subscribe, become part of the post notification game. You know what I'm saying? We on the road to a million and above, and we still got the surprise coming. Hey, so stay tuned. And put some prayers in the comments if y'all watch this video all the way to the end. Right, and pray your hands. Pray your hands us. in the comments. Please. Pray your hands in the comments. I'm about to strictly upload this video raw, like how it is. I'm not really about to edit this I video. I would have got some footage while everything was happening, but I definitely wasn't about to grab, touch, nothing. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I wasn't about to reach for nothing. I'm not reaching for nothing. Mama's sir. crack it up. You can open the car door and take me out. You can come <laughs> in and get what you want, but I am not moving. My hands is not moving from the steering wheel, my God. You feel? This is the mama. All right, y'all. We out. Love y'all. Be safe. Stay safe. We're going to holler at y'all. Peace. Peace.